through curiosity as to why this game was so bad and awful, god awful, I had done research as to why this game is so bad and why it's awful. And uh, what I found wasn't what I was looking for. I actually didn't find anything as to why this game was bad. And in my great assuming mind, that obviously means that Nintendo wanted it like this. They actually wanted no health bar or in a way challenge. But because of that, I do see what they were getting at. They basically wanted to make a game for very young children to play. And actually, what's really interesting is this isn't even a Kirby game to start with. They, the only real beta thing that they had actually planned was for the game to be called Prince of Fluff, or Prince of Yarn, or some crap like that, I don't know. And, basically, the main character was going to be Prince Fluff, a little blue dude you've probably seen walking around in the cutscenes and stuff. And, I guess Nintendo was like, ah, fuck it, he looks like Kirby, and they were like, okay, let's just rechange him into Kirby, and then they were like, no, no, man, leave him in. And so Kirby's Epic Yarn was born. While not being the most important information as to why this game sucks, uh, it certainly does actually bring some light onto this game as to why I like it. Now I'm actually starting to like it. And the fact that Nintendo actually wanted it like this, I can see that they actually accomplished their goal in making a game that is fun for all ages. Well, not fun for all ages, but fun for young ages. And, uh, let's just get on with the LP now. Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. I almost said Kirby 64. But we're not having that infinite, that infinite, that infant, we're not having that infant again. Because apparently we do not allow babies into these videos. He's of a man. And again, I'm playing Kirby. That's beside, but that's besides the point. Anyways, welcome back to, 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 to the LP. In the last episode, we finished Hotland 100%. So that means we are going to, let me make sure I got Hotland 100%. I was looking, thank you. Okay. So that means we are going to go to Treats Land. That actually sounds like a place I would want to live in because I love food. And oh, that's not food. That's toys. Where's all the food at? This music has got to be some of my favorite music in the game. And this whole level is just full of all the good music in this game. So, oh, I'm so excited. So excited. So excited. It's my favorite world. So I'm going to make a lot of... Oh, I'm so happy here. This is the only world of the game that I actually enjoyed. It adds a lot of cool functions. Kind of like the fire truck. So, this is when the game actually is good. So, that's why... This is basically the level I played this game mostly for. But, like, the way I kept playing this game. Because I got to this point, I was like, Oh, fuck, I'm not gonna stop now. It also makes that little... little whoop sound from, uh... Wario Where Twisted. I don't know if they make it sound in... in touch or any of the other ones. But they made the sound and I love it. I love it. Do the do the do the do the limbo people. Do the limbo. Violently murder that little boy. If anyone knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> ah Oh it didn't hit me. I I am so excited to get this part this part of the game. I think I might just be wrong here already. But, uh, that's the last point. Ooh, is that there? It's up there. Yeah. Shoo, man. Oh, it's left, I guess. Yeah, you go backwards, too. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello, Wattle D. Hello, Wattle D. And Wattle Do. And Wattle Do. Wattle Don't. Wattle Don't. Wattle Don't. Wattle Don't, you say. Wattle Don't, you say. Yeah, there we have it. There's a lot of money up here. There's not a lot of treasures in this. Well, there are an equal amount of treasures, but uh, treasures aren't really that hard to get here. They're all playing with toys. That's so. That's actually. Ah, I don't need to. I don't need to actually do any of these puzzles. I can play this game at my own pace. 
Even if this pace does involve retardation. Now this guy here is my favorite enemy. It's like freaking. Oh, I'm the butts man. Note that I did not say Batman. I'm, I'm really, I'm really hyper today. Uh, this is like what I meant to be. I don't know. I didn't know you could do that. Why don't you tell me these things, Mr. Ducky? Mr. Ducky, medieval duck. And I, did I upload that episode yet of uh, Minecraft, where I say medieval ducks? I need to, I need to freaking. No. Oh, uh, so basically, the, the backstory behind that I just said is I was working on a thing and I wanted to search medieval docs, and I accidentally typed in medieval ducks. I love you, Google, for using your autocorrect and saving me from that predicament. I don't want to search medieval ducks. Uh oh, this music is still got that limbo feel to it. Not, not like that. Not like that kind of limbo. But uh, you run like the, the game. You not, 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 not. like like the like the uh, uh, do the hoopla. How low can you go? How low can you stoop into no? Oh my God, I'm so hyper. So this this proves just already I am for this level. This is my favorite level in the game. So I'm just. And when I'm really enjoying myself, this is when I start getting hyper. So, this game. This game. Now, right here. If you jump in here. Get yourself crushed. Get yourself slowly crushed. As the blood flows in little Kirby's face. How do you fucking do that? Oh. Thanks for telling me, game. Real useful. Hello there. <laughs> you go over this? Take that to the car. You're a pipe cleaner man. Just one fourth. I honestly thought yard was kind of a weird design for a game, but this level man. He's not bald. In fact, he looks like the freaking Prince of Britain. Or King of Britain, I guess now. I don't even know, like, freaking. I don't know freaking shit about anything. Oh, I don't know, Mr. Robot. Mr. Robot! You can tell Tommy or some shit. You know, you've gotten to the weird side of YouTube when you're watching this. Oh shit, did we do that? Uh oh, oh, this ducky! The ducky! This is my favorite part of the whole game. Just the ducky! The fact that it's a ducky! Come on, best duck. Oh shit. It's no fun without the ducky. Without the ducky, it's a beetle. No! Don't squeak without me! Dolan, please! Ducky is now he's stolen. I'm over here, Mr. Man. Oh, this is the part where the robots are walking around. I like how they walk. I want to walk like that. I think this is a remix of uh, that one level in Mario Galaxy. And he's just crushing the enemies. I love it. I love it so much. This is just what I wanted to do. Oh, what's this? This also reminds me of that level in uh, quite a few Rayman games, but uh, most precisely the Rayman Raving Rabbids Game Boy version. I have all the versions of that game, I swear to God. I have like a million copies of that game. At a different system. Every single one on a different system. That's, ouch. But yeah, the Game Boy version of that game is just freaking totally different than the Fackin'. I got your hand! What the hell am I doing? What's this? Right there, right there? What's there? 
Oh, it's the te the sad teddy bear. He didn't give me nothing. He didn't give me nothing. <coughs> He's happy. He gave me a lollipop. And I stole it. He gave me a lollipop, so I stole it. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is actually the uncool part. Point your way out to the screen, kids! How do you do this? Oh, he goes in his own paint. Okay, fuck it. Yes. It's freaking canvas curse all over again. Also, you're very destructive, Kirby. Oh, you can turn! Hey! It's kind of like, uh... I don't know why this reminds me of Junk Bot. If anyone remembers that game, I, I freaking... Oh! Uh, I like... For like, old times' sake, I went on LEGO.com. And it was gone! And I was like, fuck you! Fuck you! I've had that game has been here since like frickin' frickin' 2000. And it's the only reason any kid in the world actually came to that website. And you frickin' remove it. You frickin' remove it. How do you do that? How do you get away with that? Come on, I'm a freaking grown ass man. I know better than. Oh, hello, sad robot. I, I frickin' suck at this level now. I don't know why I'm talking about like my, uh, my game injecty pleasures. Anyways. It is kind of like gaming guilty pleasures playing a game like that. That you haven't played in years, but... Oh, hello. Not quite ready to turn back into regular Kirby. Watch the magic happen! It didn't quite do me good. Uh, let's see if we time this right. Don't! No! No, I don't want to do this level again! Oh! Shit. I hate this level. It's the only level in the game that I actually hate. Now oh, I gotta do it again! Uh, I'll come back. I'll come back and do it later off screen. Because I don't care. And I really want to get this episode done. So I'll just come back and do it off screen sometime. You pound the mounts! The boobies! The boobies! They're the twin sisters. They're two army men hiding behind a rock. If anyone knows who that's from, by the way. There's, I the, call this rock formation, two army men hiding behind a rock. I've made so many quotes this episode now. Without people even knowing. I've actually, I think I've referenced like a hundred things in this episode people don't even recognize by now. This music is so cute. It's so cute. It's not even that entertaining of music. It's just cute. I don't know. I don't fucking know I'm a man. I'm older than this. I'm older than this! But still, it's adorable. It's adorable. Shit. It's adorable music. It's adorable! I like how it sounds like that old Kirby sound. Now this, is the, this actually isn't that bad. That's so nice! 
It's got like a cute sound at first, and it's got like that actual nice music sound. And what the fuck is that? Land squid! Oh god, it released like its poop spores. It inked. I don't know why I'm so hyper today. That's what I wanted to do this whole time. I know this game, people. Too well to be human. There's more to this game than actually doing things properly. Oh, well, you also do it like that, but if you want to do it my way, that's fine too. I love it! This game, I, 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 this is music! See, this is why I mean when I say I love this level and only this level. Oh god. Get out of here, frickin' Waddle Dew. Waddle don't! More like it! More like Waddle don't! Bitch! I'm a bit of asshole today, I don't know why. I'm like a frickin', frickin hyper douchebag. Oh shit, get up there. Shh, get up there, Kirby. Oh shit! You know what, honestly, despite all the criticism I give this game, if I didn't have it, I'd probably cry. This is like one of them games, I, you don't really know how much you love this game until, like, you don't have it anymore. Because some person, I read this, like, comment on a YouTube video, and this guy was like, I fucking hated this game until it broke, and then I cried, and I was like, what? And like, like, wait a minute, wait a minute. This is a game that I love and hate at the same time. Oh, shit. And, uh, from there, from there... I'm gonna say that I, 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 I tolerate this game to a point that I actually do kind of like it, but it is kind of easy. And I've kind of like gone through this game a little bit more, and I've realized that I'm not as hardcore of a gamer as I used to be. Because, you know, I've gone from uh, hardcore gamer to let's player. And like, when you're not let's playing, you are a hardcore gamer if you're playing, if you're freaking playing games like I do. And freaking, this game, when you're not as hardcore of a gamer, as you used to be. This game actually is, is this game is actually kind of difficult. And I think this is just, this is kind of a like yeah, I guess if it's if you're just trying to get to the end of the game it isn't really that bad. Like it isn't really that hard. But if you're trying to freaking do everything the game has to offer like I am now. I don't know why I did that. So yeah, if you're trying to do everything this game has to offer, you really do realize this game is actually, like, uh, really, uh, oh shit. Oh, if you actually throw something, we gotta be dies because it's stuff. This music is adorable! And calming at the same time. This is like the stuff that they freaking. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's this level. This level is like the best thing ever. I think it is one of the things I like about this game. It's a level design. It, it does kind of get a little girly or babyish or not really that good of level design in general, but some of these levels do have that kind of design that you just kind of like. For no reason whatsoever. You just kind of like it. So this kind of gives you that. That weird feeling in the pits of your stomach. That you don't. Oh, hello there. Oh, what the fuck. It's that weird feeling in the pit of your stomach. Might be love, might be constipation. One of the two, I just lost the beats. Whoa, that's actually really. Freaking. Oh, God. I didn't even know about the platform was that bouncy in this game. This one, if I'm correct. Yep, flings you into here. I freaking have only gotten two of the treasures now. 
Now, also, uh, this song, I think like a year ago or so, somewhere around that time, I actually favorited it on my channel. A little fun fact for you guys to live with. Well, there's a star. I missed a treasure, though. And in this big of an area, it is highly expected of me to miss something, so excuse me for that. Well, that's the way down. I learned that. The snail is evil. Like, you don't realize the snail is evil until you freaking get hit by him. And then that snail is your worst enemy for years. And, like, you want to name him Jeff all of a sudden. Because, what the hell wouldn't you name a snail Jeff? It's like, frickin'! Oh my god, I just realized that wasn't the treasure. Oh! I'm a genius! Basically what you gotta do with this one is you can't use... can't use any, uh... freaking uh... of these things. So you gotta climb up to here entirely by mushroom. That didn't sound weird at all. And that means you gotta grab these waddle doos. Carefully jump down. You can paraglide. Or parachute, or whatever you call it, so that is fine. One more. And right here he is, he's back. He has respawned. Oh shit, parachute though. If you do, uh, the, the gliding, you will not grab onto these things. So don't do that. Oh, this music! I loves it. That's supposed to say like, PewDiePie some of the lyrics here. And there we have it. I did not want to fail, so I made this episode long. I'm sorry about that. I did not mean to make it this long. But uh you guys like 20 minute episodes, and I know you guys too well to not do a 20 minute episode. So, there we go. We got a 20 minute episode. And a little bit longer. Man, I freaking. <coughs> got rubber nose and shit. I don't know how I find the time to do this. This long of recording sessions. But, you know what? Screw it. Just cake now. Holy guacamole, that is a frickin' jello cake. Oh my god, now I'm hungry all of a sudden. For cake. Holy shit. That's never happened before. Like, like I've never seen a cake in a game and I actually gotten hungry off it. And like, even this cake never has done it before, but now all of a sudden I freaking want cake. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm hyper, so excuse that. I'm gonna go get some freaking off screen go look for some food now so end of episode see you guys in the next one where i most likely will be eating but besides that i'm freaking hungry so end of recording well not end of recording but end of this episode